Okay guys, so we are in front of this Sherman tank. This is, uh, they call this the M4A 2A8 or AC8 tank. This is uh, one of the latest uh, Sherman variant that was produced during the war. This is armed with this 76.2 uh, millimeter main gun. And the width of this tank is about 9 feet. And the length is 19 feet. And you will notice here, uh, this is a uh, tank has a wide, very wide track. This is about uh, 23 inch wide. And we are going to measure it in a moment. Look at that. So that's uh, 23 inch or about uh, 59 centimeter wide. The advantage of a tank having a wider track is that uh, it lessens the ground pressure uh, on the on the ground because uh, what happens is uh, the wider the track, the greater the distribution of the weight uh, that goes to the ground. So what happens is this tank becomes uh, uh, easier to to drive on uh, soft grounds. So uh, the next uh, thing we can do is to measure the the length of the track that is in contact with the ground. So as you can see here, this uh, it starts from here, this one, up to here. That's uh, this is uh, the thing that we need to know. We can start from there. Okay, and uh, we'll eat it in it up to here. It should be. Look at that. So the length of the track of this tank that is uh, in direct contact with the ground is about 151 inch or this is about uh, 384 centimeters. Okay, so the, so from there until over there, it's about 151 inch. Knowing that the, the width of the tank is about 23 inch, and the length of the track that is in direct contact with the ground is about 151 inch. If we multiply it, then uh, it will result to about three. 3473 square inch and of course we need to consider the fact that uh, we have two track on both sides this will result to a total of uh, 6946 square inch that is uh, directly uh, in contact with the ground uh, if uh, we are going to convert it to feet, that's about uh, 48.2 square feet. That's uh, the area that is in direct contact with the ground. Okay, so uh, we need to know, actually this tank is, uh, you see the tank is about 32 feet. 32 tons so the 32 tons can be distributed 
on uh, 48.2 uh, square feet of ground which is basically good because uh, the greater the, the contact with the ground the better the distribution of the weight of this uh, of the tank which make this tank uh, better have uh, a better mobility in uh, soft ground like snow and mud